Do I have to file ISF for axial flow fans? Do I have to file an importer security filing, ISF, for axial flow fans? Let's dive right in. Before we delve into the specific requirements for filing an ISF for axial flow fans, let's briefly touch upon what ISF is. Importer security filing, also known as the 10 plus 2 rule, is a program designed by U.S. Customs and Border Protection CBP, to enhance the security of maritime shipments entering the United States. The ISF filing requires importers or their customs brokers to provide detailed information about the cargo being shipped, including the names and addresses of the parties involved, the vessel information, and a detailed description of the goods. When it comes to determining whether you need to file an ISF for axial flow fans, several factors come into play. If the axial flow fans are being imported directly into the United States, then an ISF filing is required. However, there are certain exceptions to the ISF filing requirement. If the axial flow fans are being shipped as part of a consolidated shipment, where the goods are consigned to a freight forwarder or non-vessel operating common carrier NVOCC, then the responsibility of filing the ISF generally lies with the consolidator. Working with a knowledgeable customs broker can be immensely beneficial in navigating the complexities of customs regulations, including ISF filing requirements. A customs broker can help ensure that all necessary information is gathered and accurately submitted to CBP, saving you time and potential penalties. Failing to comply with the ISF filing requirements can lead to penalties imposed by CBP. These penalties can range from monetary fines to potential delays in the clearance of your shipment. It is crucial to understand and adhere to the regulations to avoid such consequences. Understanding and complying with customs regulations, such as ISF filing, is a vital component of trade compliance. By ensuring that all necessary documentation and filings are completed accurately and in a timely manner, you can maintain a smooth flow of goods across international borders. Thank you for joining us today as we explored the question, do I have to file an ISF for axial flow fans? We hope this video has provided valuable insights into this topic. Stay tuned for more informative videos on customs brokerage, trade compliance, and international logistics. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon to be notified of all our upcoming videos. Disclaimer note below, until next time, take care and happy trading.